What's going on? Boys of girls on planet anus holes. I don't know. I'm not even saying my pop intro anymore. I just try to get creative with it. <laughs> I say Assassin's Tap is to say something weird there. Uh. Think we'll get a visit from America's most wanted? Looks like someone thought so. Oh come on, this place is abandoned most of the year. Nobody comes up here. Right, I think that's the dude in the mask actually. He's probably a good guy. He's probably the good guy in the mask. There's two guys in the mask. One of them is a well both of them are good guys really I think. I don't remember. Unless one of them is like a actual Locked. Yeah, uh, Josh wanted us to keep it locked to keep people out. He said that? What people? I, I don't know. He said they found people sleeping in the station one time. It's creepy. Homeless people. Could be. No. The station's probably like one of the warmest places in winter. Hey, what's up, yeah, then. Like. The car was closer. Guess we gotta wait. What a crazy place to set up house. I mean, no matter mm. how rich you are. Not so rich. Only bought a mountain. <laughs> Johnny bought a mountain. That's creepy. Huh? Some disease, but okay. <laughs> nice one. Just like going to the prom. Here we go. Right. Adventure begins. Oh, this was the right thing to do. What? You know, get everyone together on the anniversary. I mean, Josh seemed really pumped about us all doing something, didn't he? Yeah, no, he definitely did. I haven't seen him so excited about something in forever. Good, good. It's hard to tell with him, and I, I'm kind of worried. No, no, it was, it was a good idea. I hope everyone else feels the same way. We're all here, aren't we? Thanks, bro. Good talk. <laughs> you know what? Let's just, let's just stop talking about what happened and enjoy the trip. I don't really need to edit these videos at all. You know how Josh and I met? No. Third grade. Josh sat in the back of the room, I sat in the front. We didn't even know each other existed. But the kid sitting next to Josh started strap snapping the training bra on the girl in front of him. So the teacher made him move to the front, where I was sitting. Okay, so? So I got moved to the back. And? And next to Josh. That's how we met. I mean, and became friends to this day. A match made in heaven. If it weren't for the fact that Jeannie Simmons hit puberty like three years early, and on that day decided to wear a low cut shirt that showed off her training bra, I mean, who knows? You could be riding in this cable car alone. Right now. Or, or talking to some other person entirely. Boom. Butterfly effect. A uh, nice way to describe it, Chris. You know, setting up the feature and whatever, describing it. That's pretty good, describing it for a character. Jess, Mike's new girlfriend. Confident, trusting, irrelevant. So, I think only say like two good things about him and one bad thing. I'm not too boy, sure oh now. Oh boy. New people. Time to meet and greet. J 
Jess, hey. Jessica, over here. Uh, are you guys having a really weird stroke? Scared We're me a bit there. Uh... stupid thing. Can you please let us out? Pretty please? I thought we were goners. Another ten minutes in there and I would have chewed off my own leg. Oh, sick, Chris. <laughs> Look, got a lot of meat on my bones. It's all muscle down here. Yeah, right. <laughs> hey, Chris. I'm just doing like Sam taught me. Other people's private thoughts are my own personal playground. Do not be a jerk. My goodness. Seems that someone has a little crush on our good friend and dear class president, Michael Monroe. Chris. And what kind of sizzling erotica might our Jessica be capable of imagining? I wonder. Mike and M Split were together. Oh, drama. Not really. Pretty clear cut, actually. M's out, I'm in. Huh. All right, all right, let's just get up to the lodge already. I'm getting tired of all this nature and junk. Uh, you guys go ahead. I'm just gonna wait here for a bit. See who else is coming. You mean Mike? What? Uh, I mean, you know, whoever. Uh-huh. Sam? <sighs> Did you see this view? I mean, holy cow. Sometimes I forget to just stop and take it all in. Okay, what's the captain to now? Built the lodge like right where the cable car ends. Emily, Mike's ex, intelligent, resourceful, persuasive. Intelligent, resourceful, maybe the persuasive part is the negative part of it. I don't know. Then Mike is pretty. Matt, Emily's new boyfriend, motivated, ambitious, active. Maybe ambitious is his negative quality. No. And where's the bellboy when you need one? Oh. I remember Matt is such a cockoid. I think that's the name of it now. <sighs> getting chilled. We're almost there. No, I mean, getting kind of creeped out. Oh. Yeah. It's gonna be weird seeing everyone up here again. Definitely not gonna feel like a regular party. I mean,. What do you think? Ah! Jesus! <laughs> nice one, Mike. Emily Sachs. Intelligent, disrupt, driven, persuasive. I think driven might be his next quality. Yeah, I know him from Agents of Shield. I think it's the only thing I know him from, really. That TV show. <laughs> you guys. Michael! You really, really should have seen your faces right there. Dude, I almost clocked you just now. <laughs> nice one. Michael, you're a jerk. Come on! Guys, we're all friends here, right? No need for violence, just a little harmless fun. We're up in the woods, it's spooky. Come on, let's get spooky, in the spirit spooky. of things. The spirit of things? Seriously, what's wrong with you? I'm just trying to lighten the mood, Em. Don't be like that. Like what? The way you're being. You always get like this. Michael. I'm just gonna lay it out, otherwise this whole weekend's gonna suck ass for everyone. Um, this is super awkward, and we all know it. Let's just uh, acknowledge it now and move on, okay? Nah. I hear you, man. I get it. I don't want to make this weird. Cool. So we're good? All good. You guys gonna make out now? <laughs> oh my god, totally. We're so gonna make out. <laughs> uh, no. Seriously, I'm gonna go check on the cable. Nice one, Mike. Sure. Right. See you, man. See ya. Right. See ya. Okay, now it's cringe now. Twice, never go three times. Three times, not always what? a charm. Hey, could you take these the rest of the way? The bags? Yeah, all the bags. Oh, uh, why? I need to go find Sam. Okay. Sorry, I just, I really need to go find her. I totally forgot I needed to talk to her before we get all the way up there. This really can't wait. We're almost there. It's important. Matt, please. <sighs> All right. Fine. If it's so important, I guess I can pack horse it the rest of the way. But you owe me one. Excuse me? 
Hold them more even, at least. I'll think about it. Just be careful. See you up there, sweetie. Thank you. I have a jacket like this. It's a red one, also the Avengers one. Uh, speaking of Asian Shield, which is from Marvel, I say someone else from Marvel. I think I've had it for four years now. I think I've had it since I was 14. The Avengers Jack, I mean, he was 15. Actually, has a crush on Chris. Sure, they have a crush on each other anyway. At the Demic for fight. Think of his. In. Chris if I can't read that one. I got a bit of gum in my mouth, I be chewing on it. Well I I haven't done I can be chewing on for a while, but inconsistent I think that's it. I can't read that word. Never seen that one in my life. Never read that in a book or Whoa, hello. Hear someone say before. He's getting a little friendly. But not in the friend zone kind of way. <laughs> you might need to check the expiration date on their big breakup. Oh, oh fuck God. off. <laughs> hey, whoa. <laughs> Sorry there. Sorry about that, Ash. I didn't mean to scare Jeez you. Louise, what? Matt. I did mean to scare you, sort of scare you, but not like for real scare oh you. Oh my gosh. Oh my God. <laughs> hey, wow. Well, man, I'm, I'm really sorry, Ash. Damn. It's okay. It's fine. It's fine. What are you looking at? See anything juicy with that thing? Uh, it. Let me check it out. Mislead. Oh, let him. Um. Uh, go go ahead, knock yourself out. Yes. Oh. Son of a bitch. Seriously, Emily? What the hell, man? Hey, listen, it's probably nothing. Nothing, you think? Well, yeah. Is it ever just nothing with him? Ever? I don't know. I... God damn it. Matt. Read book, check phone. Check phone, I guess. <laughs> oh, you did not just do that. Put your hands where I can see them. We've got you surrounded. <laughs> but who am I to retaliate? What choice do I, a supple young rebel girl, have but to surrender to the strapping military guard come to take me into custody? I don't know when you put it like that. Hey! <laughs> oh! <laughs> Phrase. Hey, you know that? <laughs> Where are you hiding, little chicks? Oh! Ah. Hi! Hey! Damn. Oh! Come on. Hey, Mike. Boom, shakalaka. Okay. Oh, you got me. Okay. <laughs> you can't hide from me, Michael. I know all your tricks. I don't want to hurt a bird. I'm not. I don't. I would never hurt an animal. I don't know why. Whoa! Ow! Oh. Right! Point yes. And then what? Oh, ho! No more! Oh, 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 yeah. Oh, more. Oh, you're going down. <laughs> oh. <laughs> gotcha! Done! Done city! So, did I go down? Uh, I don't think so. <laughs> I think you'd know so if I did. Alright, alright. My, my. So are we calling it my favor then? Your worthy opponent, Miss Jessica the Snowball Queen. Okay, that sounds vaguely dirty. My lady. Hmm. What? Ah! <laughs> oh, okay. 
Okay, you're really gonna get it. What am I, I have a bit get? of fun. Well, I can think of at least one thing. Yeah. But you'll have to wait until later. We should get up to the lodge. Yeah. It's so nice out here, though. Pretty breathtaking. I mean, I could stay out here for pretty much ever, provided I was making out with you the whole time. Just making out? Quote, unquote. Well, I think we might freeze to death somewhere in between those quotes. Hmm. Yeah. Stars update. So it's a stars update. I get. I only can see like a quote of the S in the top corner. Hello again. And how are we? Pretty good. I felt that we made some good progress in the last session. I'm growing concerned about your situation. This time, we're going to try to understand the root of your anxiety. Now pick up that book, turn the pages. You will see a set of pictures and symbols. I want you to identify which image in each set makes you the most anxious. Okay. I don't know. Man, but not that type of man, you know, scruffy looking man, really. It's clouds, yes. Definitely. I don't know, I think it's because of my autism or something. I just hate parties and stuff like that. Uh, heights, I'm okay with drowning. I can swim fine. Like, I'm a good swimmer, and heights don't really scare me that much. Anyway. I, I, like, I think drowning is a much more painful way to go die, though. Like, if I had to pick a way to die. Rats are fine. <laughs> Snakes. Snakes don't really scare me, but... I would... I would definitely be, um... Oh... I'm not too sure about this one though. Oh shit, okay, nice on guns. I don't know, I think. I'm not too sure actually, I think knives would be more scary as it'd be more painful. And stuff. Knives or guns. I'm not too sure now. Actually. I think I, I I'm gonna lean more towards knives because guns are most of the time are instant anyway. Cockroaches are just insects, really. I don't really mind insects. No, there's a spider in the house. I'm the one who's got out the window, or something like that. Since I'm the only man in the house, I'm not too I'm not too sure. Clowns, I don't really mind. Scarecrows. What's this Batman? Is it? Gay Cross and Joker. Um, I'm not too sure. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not scared of either. I go for Gay Cross, man. Gore disgusts me. Cross is scary. I don't mind Gore. Again, I just go with Cross. I don't. Neither of them scare me again. Startle you? So sorry. You're doing very well. Don't be nervous. <laughs> Try to speed up. The more you rely on your instincts, the more honest your answers will be, and the more enlightening you will find this experience. Again, spiders are the mind. Snakes I don't really mind either. Oh yeah, fuck needles. Well, actually no, I don't mind needles. It's just, you know, if it's like filled with something, I don't know. Like when I go to the doctor, yeah, stick a needle on me, doctor, I'm fine with it.
But if I have no idea what's in there, I'll shit myself. But don't give me heroin or some kind of dangerous drug. Because I get, I get like two needles every year, I think. I fear dogs. I don't think you dogs have got two dogs next to me. And one from scratching the leg. Break the another leg right now. I guess needles if I don't know what's in there. Like you could be literally anything and they can make me sick, I could die from it. Storms scare me. Again, I don't mind storms. I don't not these I'm not I don't mind. Yeah, some of them I'm scared of. This is very interesting. Thank you for answering so diligent. <laughs> Snakes, scarecrows, and needles. <laughs> I don't scare. I. I'm not really scared of one of those things. I just randomly picked them. Uh, oh, oh. Well, I'm afraid. Once again, we're out of time, but I promise we'll talk again very soon. Snakes, I'm not really scared of. Not unless they're like dangerous or something like that. I'm not terrified of them. Yeah, it shouldn't scare me was about it. My, well, your stepmom is shit scared of snakes. She would be shitting herself. Oh, come on, she deserves it. I, I used to own like a snake toy as a kid. It was just a prank, Han. Maybe that's why I'm not. Maybe that's why I'm not so scared of them. Since I had a toy, I used to play with like, oh, sneaky snake. No, Little kid. <laughs> Off, I gotta say, I'm I still got that toy. I don't think I have. All my pals back to the annual Blackwood no. Winter Getaway. If I do, it's probably in my toy box. I really want to spend some quality time with <sighs> each and every one of you and um, just share some. Well, I really got my toy box now. We'll never forget. Bunch of for, for the sake of my box. I need to go find Sam. Son of a bitch. Maybe like a toy or two. So I got moved to the back and next to Josh. Oh, That's how we met. Boom. Butterfly effect. So got a lot of chance. Man, I feel like this mountain gets bigger every time I climb it. Oh yeah? That feels the same to me. Josh Han, the best brother. Complex, thoughtful, loving. Come on, you grew up here. It probably feels like it's shrinking. I guess that's true. When are you gonna install some cell towers up here? I'm getting withdrawals already. You got a spare million lying around, I, I'll fix you right up. Hmm. Funny you should say that. I, I think <laughs> I left it in my other jacket. Hmm. Oops. Hey guys, get up here okay? Yeah. Oh, well, more or less, but it was so good to see you. What's up with him? Oh. Yo, 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 you get things moving up here or what? Yeah, man. So Matt and Emily are a thing now, right? Yeah, so it seems. I mean, what's Mike think of that? I have a feeling Mike's already got his hands full, you know what I mean? Huh. Damn it. It's a freaking thing. It's iced. What else? Maybe there's another way in. There are a million ways in, they're just all locked. There's gotta be like a window around the corner we can get like, get open or something. Wait a second, are you saying we should break in? <laughs> I don't think it's technically breaking in if you own the place, right? Hey, not if I don't report you. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> lead the way, coaches. Let's go. Hey, Ash. Hi, Chris. So, how are you doing? Good, but a little cold. I think I could use some time curled up by the fire. Yeah, that does sound pretty nice. Okay, let's go. Can't believe I'm almost yeah. recording an hour already. Right. She's like a sleeper hit kind of gal, you know? 
And I just want to rip that parka right off of her and make some snow angels, right? Hey. Do I disrespect to a man? I mean, you're not going to bang her. Maybe Mike will take up the case. Wait, will you back off on Relax. Her? Just checking to see if there's some blood flowing down there. Yeah. Listen, dude, look around you. Look at these beautiful mountains. Do you see any parents? I mean, can you imagine a more perfect, ripe scenario just dripping with erotic possibilities? You and Ashley alone at last. You've laid all the groundwork. You've been a perfect gentleman. Now, you come in for the kill. Maybe you're right. Maybe you're right. You're a hunter, bro. No fear, no mercy. I mean, she won't even know what hit her. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, I got it. Yes. Don't disrespect women, though. So, how are we planning on breaking into my parents' lodge, bud? I didn't say I had a plan. You sounded like you had a plan. You better deliver, Koshis, or else you got four lovely ladies who are going to be freezing their buns off. And last time I checked, that's not a good way to get laid. Oh, shoot. Nobody likes cool buns. Uh. Well, 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 we got ourselves a thinker. Nice one. attention in climbing class you mean Jim yeah you know with the climbing up the rope well did I do that I, I don't think so here use this whoa Chris I just got an awesome idea yeah totally what, what is it okay so I'm pretty sure that I've got some deodorant in one of the bathrooms. You could use that with the lighter. I, I don't follow. How's, it, how's a stick of deodorant going to help? Spray on. It's a can. Oh, yeah. Now I got gotcha. you. Flamethrower. Just like we did with the little army dudes. Yep. Ones we melted. Just point the spray can in the lighter and whoosh. Bye-bye frozen lock. Bingo. All right, so you got this. I'm gonna go sort something out. You up for hunting around in the dark for a little bit? Nope, but I'll do it. God speak, Pilgrim. <laughs> okay, so we're in the basement of rats. Why are we doing rats? Is scaring me wrong. I've never actually seen a rat in real life. Well, I think I have, I don't remember if I have. Maybe like. Found me photo. I like bacon. I like pancakes. Bacon, pancakes, bacon, bacon, pancakes, bacon, pancakes, bacon, bacon. What the hell was it? It was the wind. Oh shit! I actually have to go for a store. Bacon, pancakes, bacon, bacon, pancakes, bacon. Why is there only these noises for when there's no one in here? Yeah. I know there's no one in here. Yeah. I see the window open up there. It's just I'll actually leave that episode there. Yeah, but the window up here is making everything go on. But um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next episode. If I guess that's the like button, subscribe, and peace.